middle of the 22nd century. The earth enjoys a period of prosperity and peace. Majority of weapons are abolished. Humanitarian and ecological problems are gradually eliminated. Any nation showing aggressive tendencies is dealt with swiftly by UN military forces. Eventually, the Earth is a conflict-free zone. In this enlightened atmosphere of unity, scientific progress accelerates. Two thousand five hundred and sixty three. Over fifty years of dedicated research comes to fruition when the UN nuclear research laboratories successfully combine elements of Einstein's unified field theory with antimatter physics, creating a new form of spacecraft propulsion. A new form of power can literally warp the fabric of space and therefore bring points within it closer together. This makes travel between solar systems in a relatively short time period a distinct reality. reality. Two thousand five hundred and seventy five. Two fully equipped research ships leave Earth. Their mission is to find other Earth type planets suitable for colonization. Explorer 1 is listed as missing, presumed dead. Explorer 2 completed her mission successfully, returning to Earth after locating several habitable planets in a distant but reached section of the galaxy. Explorer 2 is refitted in space dock and made ready to travel back to the new planets. A strange uprising begins on Earth. People are becoming hostile and overthrowing the establishment. A bloody conflict ensues in which the growing number of rebels are victorious.
doing this. Last order of the old regime was the emergency departure clearance for Explorer 2. Explorer 2 leaves the solar system behind and heads for the new planet. The new launch window causes the ship to pass through an uncharted asteroid field on its way. There is damage to the warp field generators. 2621. Explorer 2 arrives at the new solar system. The crew escape using safety pods. Most do not make it to the new Earth. Shortly, a new Earth colony is formed. The struggle for survival begins. Present day. New Earth colony is now well established and close to old Earth technology at time of uprising. A new leader has emerged with the full backing of the populace. His mission to return to space and reconquer the Earth. To reunite 